Hi students, today let's read a very creative essay, an autobiography of an elephant. So you have to imagine yourself to be an elephant and narrate your story in this essay. I was born in a jungle. Till I was seven, I had led a wild and free life with my companions. One day, a tame elephant entered the jungle. Tame means domesticated, not wild. He offered to lead me to a sugarcane plantation. I was stupid enough to believe him. I did not know that he was a decoy. That is, an elephant trained to lead his wild brothers into captivity. That means somebody wanted to capture them. So, a decoy means like a trap. While following him, I suddenly fell into a big pit. I had not noticed the pit as they had carefully covered it so that the poor elephants like me could be caught. Such traps or enclosures are called kedars. Next para. I was left in that pit for nine days. I had nothing to eat. I grew terribly weak. And if I had remained there in that condition for two or three days longer, I would have perhaps, perhaps starved to death. On the tenth day, I was taken out of the pit and brought into a town. I was gradually tamed, that is domesticated by human beings. I was trained to act as I was ordered. Next para. My master treats me with kindness. He never neglects to meet my needs. He prov provides me with plenty of leaves, grass, roots and bulbs to eat. I help him in many ways. I carry huge loads for him. I pile timber. Timber is wood. Sometimes he lends me to huntsmen. If somebody is going hunting, then they may borrow that elephant. That is you. Huntsmen sit on my back and drive to the spots where they can find tigers and fire at them. Once I was lent to a Maharaja. That day I was painted with bright colors and covered with silk and velvet clothes. I was used in a state procession. So the Maharaja along with all his uh, servants were going for a procession on the streets. So he would obviously sit on a royal elephant. With the Maharaja on my back, I walked with an air of proud majesty. Next para. I enjoy myself very much when I am led into a tank for my bath. I draw up water by my trunk and skirt it all over my body like a shower bath. Last para. Though I have to live a life of, life of captivity, that is, he is captured, imprisoned, I am not at all unhappy. So he seems to be quite content with his life because he's taken care of well. I have learned many things by living with men. My master takes every care to make me feel comfortable. I don't think my wild brothers are happier than me. So... Though autobiographies may not come in your exam, the aim was to shake up your imagination, learn new vocabulary. Hi students, if you found this video useful, press the like button. Also to enroll for my online lectures or online test series, email me or message me on Instagram. Check the description for more information.